Good morning, everyone. This is Tall Creek Rock back for another exciting day here on the Ark Survival Evolved Volgaro map. This is day 38 of my little adventure here. And well, today I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna take my mammoth over to the little island and farm me up a bunch of wood and thatch because I'm pretty short on thatch. It's one thing I need really bad. I need to clean his inventory out a little bit first, though. And I guess I've basically got enough berries for everything here, so I can just probably dump some of those. I did get me a pteranodon again, so I can fly once more. Pretty short on meat, though. Probably need to do a meat run at some point. Not sure how I'm going to even do that, though. don't have any carnivores and it's kind of hard to well I guess the pteranodon is a carnivore but I never really hunted any with a pteranodon but I think I'm just going to do some wood farming right now I actually need thatch really bad and the mammoth collects a lot more wood than it does thatch but I'm going to use it anyway Let's make sure you're on passive again. Don't want you jumping off the boat for any reason. be a disaster if you mammoth jumped off a boat. What do I keep hearing over here? Sounds like a peg on the stack, so I ain't seen one yet. It may just be one of those ichthyornis birds flying over and I didn't, didn't spot it. But I'm going to see how well he can do it farming wood over here on this island. May eventually build over here. i got a problem though. I can't seem to get a Diplodocus on a raft, so I don't know how I'd ever get my Diplodocuses over here without just swimming them over here. Maybe if I build my raft out a lot bigger, maybe they will actually be able to get on it. Don't know, though. But I'm going to go over here and level up Pauline a little bit on this island and collect a lot of wood and stuff. Get some use out of her. Mammoths are really good for collecting this stuff. Don't really need the berries. I guess I'll just wind up dumping those pretty soon. But I'm going to go ahead and farm them so I can get some level ups going. Let's see how we do on these trees. Pretty good stack of wood, I guess. A lot more than I would have gotten. Forestate this whole island. It ain't gonna take long like this, is it? I've just run out of stamina, haven't I? No, I am about maxed out on weight here. Let's see, let's just start dumping stuff. I don't need all these berries. Should save the narco ones though. Yep, yeah, that should be alright. Give me a little bit more carrying capacity. I'll start leveling up the mammoth's carrying capacity, I guess. Oh, that's me. Let's get the mammoth going here. I want to carry more. 
Yep, that didn't go up very much. Well, that's quite a pile of junk there I left, ain't it? This is definitely the way to collect wood. Not too bad on berries either. I know I never even thought about taking my Diplodocus out, but they could really probably really collect berries even better than the mammoth can. But I don't really need berries right now. Get sap out of that stump. I did get a little bit, didn't I? Well, I'm probably not going to be able to completely deforestate this island because I'm not going to be able to carry all of it. I'll have to head back to base and make another trip. Might have all the wooden thatch I need for a while, though. Might even work on expanding my raft out here so I can carry maybe get a different docus on it. I did unlock foundations again, so I could be working on some stuff like that. Span this raft out to about three or four blocks wide. I don't have ceiling pieces yet, though, so I can't really do that. But my level ups are coming pretty quick. Maybe if I start crafting a bunch of this stuff, I'll be able to do do the ceiling pieces pretty soon. Come on, Parasaur. Out of the way. Got a ton of stuff to unload here. Ralph ain't nothing bad been around, have they? Or radar, I mean. Keep calling him Ralph because I used to have a parasaur named Ralph. I have to get over that though. This one's called Radar. Let's see what do we want to take in. Let's take the thatch first because that's the thing I was coming up short on on everything. Maybe one stack of wood. Let's see what I need to turn these off for sure. what I need here. I'd like to craft a couple more stone foundations just to fill in this spot right here. 80 stone per foundation. Let's go ahead and craft as many of those as I can. Looks like I can only do two. And how much is those really taking? 320 thatch or just 30? I'm looking at it wrong. It's just taking 30 thatch a piece. Wood and stone, I could make some more. Go ahead and make some more. I'm going to 
make the raft out of stone also. stone I can make a few more. If I had my building here all out of stone, I'd, at least I wouldn't have to worry about T-Rex destroying it too awful quickly. And I got me another level up there. Let's see what we're going to do with this. We might do some stone ceilings now. More into carrying capacity again. And we're at level 47. So let's get down here and see what we can do at level 47. We're up to grappling hooks. It takes 40 points to do it though. So I won't be doing that. Megalodon saddle at 47. Let's try to unlock all this stone stuff. I need to be building things. We need stone ceilings. Stone door frames. Can I not get those? Apparently I cannot. Stone walls, I guess. That only leaves me with eight. I'd like to have some ramps. Where's the ramps at? Wooden ramps. Let's unlock those. That leaves me with five. Let's do the railings. And I guess I could unlock gunpowder again. That pretty much takes everything. What have I got in here now? I've got quite a bit of spark powder. I could start making some gunpowder going here. That would probably give me another level up pretty quick. Get that going. Grab all my charcoal. Doesn't appear to have much left, do I? Not as much as I thought I would have had. Turn that into gunpowder, though. see about replacing some of these floors here with stone. Yeah, I guess that's good for in here for now. I could do one more. Or I could save them for my raft. I guess I want to save these for my raft. I want a stone floored raft. And here I am picking up poop again. Got a lot of wood I need to unload from my mammoth, and I need to go collect that. This seems to be full. So let's toss one of those and put a heavier one in there. Toss that. Let me see if I can throw a couple of foundations on my boat. Yeah, there's more poop, but I'm going to skip that for now. Let's see how I need to do this. Okay, I need to put one directly in front. Remember how to even do this. Need them to be pretty straight. That looks good, but it's right up in that. Let's see, how straight does that look? Now let's pick it up. It doesn't look all that great.
try to keep it off the rudder this time if I can is that any better maybe I need a couple more of those. I need to run and get that blue drop before it goes away. Okay, let's go get that real quick here. Radar. Maybe that's something good over there. Let's hope for a good drop. I got a pike. I can make a pike now without having to have Ingram for it. That's good. I was picking up something over there. What was I picking up? Head back to base. I still got some crafting to do. Get that raft built up a little bit. I need two more stone foundations and I need a bunch of stone ceiling pieces. Let's see here. What was that pike? Is it just a regular pike? No, it's actually quite a good one. Another medium crop plot blueprint. That ain't bad either. Can I not stick that in there? I did, so I can actually make a good pike now. But I'd rather have a sword or a pike. I'll just stick with my sword for now. Crafting, I need... What do I need to craft up some more stone foundations? I need at least two more of those. Thatch and wood. I'm probably not going to have enough thatch. Yeah, I might can do it. More wood. And I need more stone to make the ceiling pieces. Something's thumping my house. What do I need to make these ramps with? Fiber? I don't need wood, I need fiber. And I think I'm going to run out of stone here is what's going to happen now. Looking like... Let's craft us up a few ramps if we can. Or am I just out of thatch now? Yeah, we got a little bit done here. Let's go put this on the raft. And unload my mammoth and we'll see about collecting up some stone, I guess, next. Surely I can handle some diplodocus when I get this done. Oh, it ain't gonna let me place this here. 
to place them out any further is the question. I know I can place one here, I'm pretty sure. Can I get one out here? I might have to do the ceilings out. So I hope I can place one here. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's get the ceilings put up. I've only got two of them. I'm not happy about only having two. got to craft some more stone ceilings now. If I want to make a sizable boat here, and what am I liking? I've not got enough stone. I'm going to have to figure out some way of farming stone more efficiently. Which means I'm probably needing to tame a Dodicurus. And I'm going to have a hard time unloading this wood one stack at a time. Do I have any stone left here? I do not. I'm thinking I'm going to throw up another chest here to put uh, wood in. I've got one right here. Put all that wood off that mammoth in this. Get this thing somewhat straight. See what that looks like real quick. That's pretty good, I guess. Let's load that up with wood. I wish I still had my carrying capacity that I had earlier. I could do this a lot faster. Because I've only been able to carry one here, one stack at a time. I've got another chest here. I didn't realize that. Get this gunpowder out of my inventory. Maybe I can carry two stacks. Throw them arrows in there too. That'll give me a little extra. Little extra ability. Yeah, I might get two stacks at a time like that. Just barely. I guess I need to make getting a Dota Curious one of my next priorities. Because stones are holding me back now. And I know where a high level one is. I hate wasting the day doing this kind of stuff. But it needs to be done. If I hadn't lost 150 pounds off my carrying capacity, I could have probably carried four stacks at least. I won't be needing to make a wood run anytime soon now.
Just about done with this. I think I'm going to take my Tranodon out and look for supply drops after I get this done. Because this is really boring. Looks like he got another level up. Let's give him some more weight. 696 to 723. I need to remember to grab my arrows back. I think I put them all in here. Got 150 in here. I'll just take 100 for now, though. Put the other 50 in with my narcotic arrows. Keep track of stuff better. I thought you could sort stuff by name, but it doesn't seem to be letting me do that. Okay, are we out of meat? Probably. Don't have a lot on you. Give you a little more stamina. Put you up over 400 see what I'm carrying here. Uh, we should be good to do a little riding now, I think. Of course, the day's getting pretty pretty late already. Do we see any drops? Just that one way over in the Arctic. We're not going to be going for one over in the Arctic. Let's be flying over this way. Something's bound to drop eventually, close by. I'd explore that hillside over where I've seen more ruins at. Got to do something today besides just gathering wood. Very, very cautious of my stamina. There's a Dodicurus and Apache Rhinosaurus. That's not a good place to land, I don't think. I wanted to check the Dodicurus' stats. Wow, it's a 145. Yep, I was afraid of that. I think it was just a Gallimimus, though, but boy, it sure spooked me. There's a green supply drop. Let's head that way. Thought I was raptor pounced. This is the one that's on the little island in the middle of the water. Hope there's no baryonyxes anywhere near it. It's a green one with a ring around it, so it'll probably be some pretty good supplies. Just be careful here. My stamina is about drained. Can I land here is the question. Wow, is it slowing down? Can I even carry this stuff? What did I get there? I got a Looks like flaming arrows and some weird, a real high level raptor saddle, Mastercraft. Wow. A whip. A boomerang. Never used boomerangs before. Bunch of arrows, another complete set of desert cloth armor, and a blood extraction syringe. Use this on a human to extract their blood for transfusions. Some wooden fence and it looks like another ramp. And boy, that was loaded down with stuff, wasn't it? I need to see if I can actually kill stuff with this Tranodon because he's going to run out of meat pretty soon. I need to just find a low level Parasaur, I guess, and see if he can kill it. loaded down to. I'm just barely moving. Poor old Tranodon can't hardly carry this much stuff. He's got incredibly high melee damage. I want to see if I can do anything with him. Just 
Anki's over here. Sure ain't gonna try to attack an Anki. What's this trend on this stuck over here? Level 50. Yep, stamina's gone. Let's land here. I'm gonna have to go unload this stuff. So I'm just barely flying. And that was fast speed also. It'd be bad if I can't fly across this lake like this, and I may not be able to. This ain't good. Surely I'm not going to mess around here and get my pteranodon killed because I can't fly across the lake. See if there's some of the stuff I can dump. Good thing this rock's out here in the middle. What can I drop? I don't want to drop any of it. Yep, I don't want to drop none of that stuff. Let's just try to make it. Suns are going down on me, looks like. That was a really good loot crate, though, with all that desert cloth in it. for another land and I guess top of this little rock's the best place. Purple drop way over there. If I could get home in time to dump this stuff, I could possibly get it, but it'll probably be long gone before I can do that. Let's put that as my goal for right now. Got to start putting some weight into this sarge or into this pteranodon. Need stamina and weight. about burnt through already again. Don't like that a bit. Purple drop gone already. Yeah, nope, it's still over there. It's way over there, though. I probably won't be getting that. got on your inventory? Just a little bit of meat? Yeah, you're just about out of meat. And I'm loaded down. I haven't ever used fire arrows before either. That's something new for me. Flame arrows. Light the target on fire. Can also light a oil slick. 
stick it in here. Parachutes. Sometimes I could, I've used those a few times. An extra ramp. I guess I'm just going to throw the building supplies in this chest. I could put some wood railings up on my building, but I'm not really ready for that just yet. And the desert cloth armor, we got a full set of hide in there. That's what we got in this chest. And we could put the weapons in this chest. Yeah, I guess I'll throw the parachutes in there also. Where have I got my saddle blueprints at? Got a really good Raptor saddle blueprint here. Wonder what it takes to make it. 1600 hide. If I had a really good Raptor, that would be nice. And let's see if we're going to do this extra set of desert cloth here. Got this full already. I could take this out though. Take the weapons out of here, throw them in another chest. Put the desert cloth in here with this stuff. Be my backup supplies right there, I guess. And we got these extra extra tools. That chest is getting close to being full, but I'm gonna stick all this in here if I can. Don't want that spoiled meat in there. Daylight is running out on me. Now I've got to feed this Tranodon. Let's see here. You've only got a few pieces of meat on you. I think I've got a little bit left in the chest here. Give you that. Hold you for a little while. And that purple drop is still there. Let's go for that. You can fly pretty fast. Might be something really good. We've got just a little bit of time before it gets dark. I should be able to open all the purple drops now. I think I'm at like level 47. Now is it safe here is the question. Just have to go for it. That's something good. Dunkleosis saddle. Have to land for stamina here. Let's see what I got real quick here. I got a, oh yes, an ankylosaur saddle already made. That's great. I have to go take That'll be the plan right now is to go find me a good ankylosaur tomorrow. Put that saddle on. I know where a 140 is. Let's get back to base, stash this stuff for now. So that was a pretty good drop for us too. Pre-made ankylosaur saddle with a lot of armor. Night time is falling fast. look at that saddle one more time. It's got 39 armor on it. It's just an apprentice one, but it's still pretty good. And then a blueprint for a scope attachment. Had the scope attachment unlocked already, but, but it's locked again. Let's put this stuff up. 
put the saddle in there in the saddle blueprint. Probably won't ever use that Dunkleosteus or whatever it is. Don't know. Put the scope blueprint in here. And well, I think I'm going to call it another day. It's getting dark again. You can't make good videos at night. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And thanks again for watching. This is Tar Creek Rock signing out.